ask your dog what you preferred, treats or praise. I, I think they'd pick treats, don't you think? I mean, they probably wouldn't answer. <laughs> but yeah, but you would think, you think so, so, right? So. Yeah. Go for the food. But researchers at Emory University say vocal praise means as much, if not more, than food as a reward. And so here's how they figured it out. Neuroscientists use an MRI to scan the dog's brains. For 13 of the 15 dogs, small study, right? But still, okay. 13 of the 15, their brains lit up just as much or even a little bit more for the verbal praise as it did for the food. I don't know about this. My dogs won't do anything unless it involves food, and we praise them all the time. This is good news for me. I had a chihuahua, chihuahua lover, right. for 11 years, mm. and she was the alpha. You know, I did both. Um, you did the she praise, didn't she, really, did the she didn't really obey me, but just loving on her and <laughs> petting her and telling her she's a good girl. And now I have a new puppy, and we're going down the same road. Yeah. She's she's about nine months old now, and I do both. I just less food, more spoil. praise, maybe. Maybe I find it works with my coworkers, like more praise, like it's very uh, effective. When you bring in food, though, it's also when you, it's, when you bring food, it's very effective. It is very Everybody motivating. Yes, yes, it is. <laughs> Looking for your feedback? Does your dog respond more to treats or praise? We'd love to hear your thoughts on Facebook or you can comment on Twitter as well. Earlier, we told you that researchers at Emory University found that vocal praise for your dog means as much, if not more, than food as a reward. A neuroscientist actually used an MRI to scan the dog's brains. For 13 of the 15 dogs, their brains lit up just as much or even more for verbal praise as for food. So we were curious what you had to say. Robert Moffat, Bob says, why not offer both? The time and affection we give our dogs is returned to us tenfold. Aw, so I like true. That one. Bob's such a nice guy. On Facebook, Victor says, I have one food driven and one dog that I'm guessing is really just looking for that verbal praise, praise and play driven. There's no one size fits all training when it comes to a dog. And Sue says, I've had dogs all my life. My labs responded very well to praise as they tried to please me. My basset hounds, not so much. <laughs> They're food driven and I have to make it worth their while to do what I ask them. I used to have a basset hound and Sue, I know what you're talking about. <laughs> it is a tough go with them. The praise doesn't work so well. Thanks everybody for your feedback.